Story tonight, one person is dead after a fire in South Buffalo that destroyed a home and a garage on Parkview Avenue. Now the fire happened around 11 o'clock last night. Two on your side's Rob Hackford joins us live now from where that home will soon be demolished. Rob? Yeah, Scott and Mary Ellis, the home behind me here, we actually just saw a fire investigator as well as a city water crew stop by that water crew turning off the main to the home in preparation for demolition, which they discussed would potentially be happening tomorrow morning. Now, I've been speaking with neighbors, all who've been stopping by after this a tremendous fire, the smoke, the smoke really spreading throughout the entire neighborhood, bringing people out and family and friends of that 40 year old man who, who died after this fire of a heart attack actually have been stopping by as well, trying to comprehend what happened. The Buffalo Fire Department has not released this individual's name officially, so we are also not identifying just because this fire is so fresh, less than 24 hours old at this point. Buffalo firefighters again responding just after 11 p.m. last night. Neighbors telling us it was a pretty chaotic scene that smoke spreading far and wide. You can see that in the video. Uh, the Buffalo Fire Commissioner telling us the man who died was one of four people in the home when the fire started. Two other people, including an elderly woman on the first floor who got some help from a neighbor to get out and a relative of the 40 year old also got out. They suffered some smoke inhalation issues. The fourth individual, however, was another relative of that 40 year old who ended up jumping out of a third floor window after a firefighter tried to rescue him but got injured. He actually took a 24 foot ladder, ground ladder, which is the largest or longest uh, ground ladder we have on one of our pumpers, and he raised it to the garage on his own, got to the top of the garage, brought the ladder up to the garage, and set it on the top the roof of the garage to get to the third floor, but as close to that third floor window as he could. And during that process is when he suffered his burns, and uh, the individual, unfortunately, we didn't reach him in time, and he left. Yeah, that individual suffered some serious injuries to his hip and pelvis area. The home was so badly damaged, the city has issued an emergency demolition permit. One entire side of it completely burned over by a garage that's actually uh, adjacent to the home, not the home's garage itself, though. Uh, there is no word on when demolition is officially going to start. As I just said a, a few minutes ago, the city crew talked about tomorrow being that timeline, given just the, the state of the building at this point. But we'll continue to keep you updated as well as provide the name of the individual killed, the 40 year old, as soon as we have that confirmed with the Buffalo Fire Department. For now, reporting on your side in South Buffalo, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.